Hi, this is James Honecker. I am doing a home study of my own house because I can't seem to get anybody else down here to do it. <coughs> we'll go outside and start on the outside. My car. Okay, this is the outside. I live at 828 Kanawha Avenue, Raynell, West Virginia. The number is marked on the house. Let's go in. Okay, we come into the living room, and the first thing, you'll see the wall of my achievements, my college diploma from Walter State. My GED, my first aid and CPR, uh, my certificate of achievement for the president's list, my completion of the CNA training, and my successful um, test for CNA. <coughs> It's not a huge room, but it's comfortable. Uh, you have pictures of me and my daughter Kelly. The TV. More family pictures, Kaylee, her brother Gage, and me with my grandparents. It's different family pictures, my brother and his wife. Turn the light on here. It might brighten it up a little bit. So yeah, that's the living room area. Now we'll go into the kitchen. been doing a lot of renovations around here. You can still see there's still drywall. Uh, one of the fire escape things. Small bathroom. You post the house rules in here. And it is clean. So I realized when I went to edit the video and check it out and see what's going on that it cut off the end of my little my home study thing. So where it cut off was here in the bathroom. It was showing that the toilet was clean and that there is a sink and there's hand soap to wash your hands. Hot water is hot and cold water, so there's running water in here, of course, toilet paper. <coughs> um, the house rules are on the wall, because everybody uses the bathroom, so there's no way to miss it. Now we're in the kitchen. Um, this is the kitchen table, <coughs> Excuse me. where we would eat meals together as a family, and so forth. Then we have the microwave. And below that, serverware, pot holders, serverware. Yes. Yeah. Spit forks or knives, spoons, spoons, forks, things like that. <coughs> Underneath, everything's kind of thrown in. It's crazy. Pots and pans, dish towels, thermos, different necessities for cooking. Kitchen sink, clean, hot water, cold water, um, 
always have hand soap, dishwashing stuff in the kitchen. Dishwasher. The, the range, which is also, I think it's fairly clean. <coughs> Underneath food, various food stuff in here. Coffee creamers. This is not booze. This is uh, balsamic vinegar stuff I like to cook. A lot of different things. I don't keep alcohol in the house. More food in the cabinets. <clears throat> and they're they're pretty big cabinets actually. Yeah. Fire extinguisher near the stove. It's electrical fire fabric cloth wood. Trash, grease fires, different things. I always keep that next to the stove. <coughs> Here are my dishes and storage things and glasses. Stuff like that. Spice rack. More food. More food. Uh, more food. Rice. Different things. Um, smoke detector. We always like to test these. I do it every two weeks just to make sure because batteries are kind of crappy. Works. Works well. Very loud. This is Adam's room, little brother. Um, he stays with me now. <coughs> and he helped build this room, so he picked it, chose it for his room. We go through the door over here to laundry, well, the utility room. More food in the freezer. All kinds of stuff. clean. Not very well organized, but it's clean. All the food's good. There's no bad stuff. Uh, laundry, washing machine, dryer. Um, that's about it for in here. His closet. That's the next. Okay. <coughs> so we'll go upstairs. You have to remember this house was built in 1929. So it has its rough spots. I did not paint this room, but this is my room. Right here. My bed. Different stuff. Laundry. Uh, my desk, which is a mess right now. Uh, TV cabinet. I like to read a lot. <coughs> this is the room that is slated to be Kaylee's room. And there's not a lot in here right now because she's not here. Her toys are here. There's another fire evacuation route. The state of West Virginia requires that I have these two of them um, because where I adopted, where I've got my little brother, um, they require me to have fire evacuation routes with clear instructions. 
And there's another copy of the house rules. <coughs> and there's a dry erase board. I try to keep a little like life lesson or an inspirational thing on here. It changes pretty often. Every couple of days, maybe every four days, we change what that says. Um, it's the upstairs bathroom. Sink. There's the hand soap. Toothbrushes, toothpaste, low water, hot water, cold water, towels, washcloths, various medical supplies. Um, and the medicine cabinet is just regular stuff, aspirin, things like that. Uh, shower. Plenty of soap, body wash, different stuff like that. Shower. Shower works good. Need a new shower head. That one uses too much water. It's like five or six gallons per minute, which is a huge amount of water. Upstairs, the heat is the old baseboard style heating. Does a great job. Downstairs, it's an electric furnace. Oh, I know. Smoke detector. It's required to have one where every bedroom can hear it. So, here in the hallway, if you can see, that's right there in between the bedrooms and the hallway upstairs. And it also, nice and loud, can't miss it. So, that's it for my tour of my house, home study, you can hopefully see that everything's in order here and safe and sound and well, there's a railing going downstairs so you know that's up to code and everything um, let me see, make sure I'm not forgetting anything Oh, there are safety locks on these doors. The keys put up right now, so it's a magnetic thing. You touch it and unclasp it, but you can't open these. That's where the bleach is and different cleaning stuff. Microwave is just as clean as any microwave. It's stained a little bit, but it's clean. And I guess that is just about it. That's my house in a nutshell. Um, turn on the light so you can see in here one more time just to see this angle. <coughs> movies, entertainment. Um, under the TV there's a PlayStation 3 and a Wii. And they have satellite and cable both. Just to make sure that everybody can have some kind of entertainment here. Can't really zoom out any further. Let's 
so yeah, that's it for my house. As you can see, it's clean, um, safe, uh, it's adequate, there's enough room for everybody. <coughs> Kaylee's bed, um, the frame is up there, as you can see, there's a big box on the floor. Uh, we just, I don't want the bed to get dusty sitting there without use, so it's in storage with plastic and everything. So, that's my house in a nutshell. That's pretty much it. Thanks for watching this. And thank you for your time.